Now, your WLKY weather with meteorologist Daniel Johnson. Well, we've had some really nice late summer weather with temperatures in the 80s, the humidity staying low, and it's going to stay that way for the next couple of days. And then eventually things will heat back up to summer-like weather with increased humidity as well. We'll talk about that in a few minutes, but here's a live look outside. A really nice night across uh, the entire region with cur uh, current temperatures in the 70s. 76 degrees here in downtown, outside the city already down into the 60s. The humidity right around 62%, and that's typical. It, it increases at night as the temperature begins to drop off, but it is relatively comfortable and it will stay that way for the next couple of days. 85 was today's official high. 83 is where we should be, so a, a pretty average day, I would say. 63 was the low, and we should be at 62. Temperatures, as I mentioned, already down into the 60s, just outside of Louisville, Taylorsville, 65, Shelbyville, 66, English, 67, E-Town, down to 63 degrees already. A few spots could drop into the upper 50s like the past couple of nights. Most of us in the low 60s for overnight lows. Dew points, we've been showing you this all summer long. You're probably an expert at what dew points are, right? Dew points, just a measure of moisture out there. And when these numbers are above 65, that's when it really starts to feel uncomfortable. You want these numbers at 60 or below, and that's pretty much where we are. And that's where those numbers will stay the next couple of days. So low humidity. That's it's going to feel pretty nice. Lots of active weather well to our northwest, but that's where it will stay for the next couple of days. We're going to be rain free, but the Atlantic is beginning to become quite active here. This is Tropical Storm Fiona, and it is slowly strengthening. The National Hurricane Center is expecting it to strengthen over the next few days. Here's the latest path. The information coming in at the 8 o'clock advisory, it has it drifting to the west, going toward Puerto Rico as a tropical storm, and then lifting north and east still as a tropical storm because it, as it goes across Hispaniola, lots of mountains there, so it's going to keep it pretty weak. Now, here's the question. Will it go west toward Florida or the Gulf of Mexico, or will it stay more to the northeast side of the cone and maybe hook away from the U.S.? That's the big question. We're still several days out and we have to determine that. Yesterday's models had this system staying away from the U.S. and we were like, okay, good news. Today's forecast models have been hitting it toward Florida and even portions of the Mid-Atlantic. So we're going to watch it closely as uh, we go through the next few days. 64 degrees here in town tonight with clear skies. Tomorrow, 86. So similar to today, just a, de a degree or two warmer. Lots of sunshine out there and a bit hazy at times as well. Heading to Bourbon and beyond, it's looking great. Kings of Leon, that's the headliner at 9.30 tomorrow night, 75 as they begin. As the gates open tomorrow, we're at 80 degrees, 85 by the afternoon. Friday night football looking perfect for all the kids heading out there in their football games, 84 at kickoff, upper 70s toward the end of the game. Future cast, kind of boring, not much to show you, lots of sunshine for the next several days. So if you want the sun, you're gonna love the weather heading through tomorrow and into the weekend because it's all sunshine. Temperatures climbing day by day by a degree or two. Eventually next week, we're into the low to maybe even mid 90s, especially Tuesday, Wednesday. Gladys, the first day of fall is Thursday. I have us at 89, but I think tomorrow when I come in, I might have to bump that up into the 90s. So first day of fall is looking hot. It's looking hot, but then we're going to slowly make that decline. Statistically, we should. So you're right. We will. All right. I'm hoping for it, yeah. you know, because I just need a fall feeling Thanksgiving. As long as these 90s don't go too far. Too crazy. And I'm ready to get a pumpkin already. Don't go too crazy. Yeah. <laughs> Me too. All right, Daniel, thank you.